We are going to, where are we going, Mama? Store. Going to the store. Oh no, you can do another one. All righty. Let's get these fucking RDLs done. Yum. Now, because I don't, this is why you prep your foods, guys, so you won't be in a predicament like me trying to. Hi. Oh, we. What do you say? Hi, buddy. Hi, everybody. Coffee. Breakfast. Hash browns, egg whites, and turkey bacon. Because we're hungry today. So hungry. Cheers. All right, guys. It is Monday morning. Just doing some housekeeping for work, updating some of our Excel sheets for the staff members to work on for authorizations and such. So this takes up a lot of my time, basically every single morning. <laughs> Hello there, Jackie. <laughs> Hello. morning happy tuesday just finished a solid shoulder workout and when i say solid i'm i'm hurting right now so successful workout it's, an, it's part of my new program so really excited um checked in with coach already this morning when i woke up it was like 4 30 sent in my photos sent in my um answers to the the weekly check-ins so we'll see what she says. We'll see what she says. Um, on the way home right now, I'm super hungry. I want to eat ASAP. So gonna get some protein pancakes I already made. Um, probably add in some egg whites, um, maybe turkey bacon, we'll see. And maybe a bagel. Today's a high carb day, so I am trying to maximize the food I get today. Um, and then make myself a coffee. I've honestly been making one to two cups a day um, ever since I got my new Bravo machine and it's been amazing. So I'll eventually do a review on that once I, one, get the hang of things and two, kind of like understand more of how it works because it's just not an unfair review if I just base off of it like right now. Um, essentially it is quite user friendly, but if you don't know how to make espresso, like it's, you know it's kind of like difficult so I'm still learning as I'm going um yeah I'm tired I'm, I'm tired I'm just I just wish I can go to sleep and nap and all the things because it's gloomy right now and when it's gloomy I just want to stay inside and just hibernate all right well I shall see you guys in a bit morning coffee that will last me till basically this afternoon and my breakfast i'm super excited because look at this look at all of this all right guys i dropped jackie off i got a mother's day gift that she created let's see what she made um oh okay, I'm gonna this. oh how cute is this it's a like coffee mug. It says um, number one mom. How cute is this? You're the best. Oh, 2024. This is so cute. Oh, I love I love all of her little activities and crafts they do at daycare. This is so cute. I can't wait to use it. I'm gonna use it like. ASAP. I don't think there's anything else in the bag. Um, short. Nope, that's it. That is super cute. I love it. So, you guys already know I'm new to the vlog game. I really am just learning as I'm going. Um, but the thing is, I've always loved watching people's vlogs, right? Like, I just find it really unique. Um, and cool on how everyone kind of showcases their style. You really see um, 
how they think or like what is like their um like their branding like what makes it them um everyone has different styles so i'm very drawn to the vloggers who have very like cinematic styles but also like so that's more lifestyle right so if someone is in lifestyle and they're vlogging their travels day-to-day -day life um fashion stuff like that like i just love watching and then there's also like i love watching kind of like people in um health and wellness fitness like i love seeing like um things kind of like what how they say it, like raw like where there's not over um over edited you know it's just very like straight to the point um so yeah I, I have like various ones that i like to look after but of course there are some of those vloggers out there who really create just amazing visual diaries and they encompass everything that i like to watch right so they they incorporate lifestyle they incorporate like traveling they incorporate like workouts and it's really cool um watching it and it's a really it's a really good way for me to kind of like pull inspiration and kind of like learn more um and i'm, I'm like i said i'm still learning um from things such as like the well the one thing i'm really working on right now is audio because I want to get like consistent audio I want it to be where it's like you don't have to fluctuate so much with like volume when you're watching my videos um, so definitely something that I am working on um, and just like learning how to like better fine-tune my mics or like what my settings should be at just so that I can get the best quality not only footages but also audio um, and on top of that like learning how to edit more and and like I'm saying, I am not, I'm in the beginning stages. There is no huge investment. I am not using some fancy programs because I feel like if I don't understand the basics, I don't understand the equipment that I'm currently working with or understand like what setting does what, um, whether it's on my equipment or on my software. It's like, there's really no point in dropping a whole bunch of money for stuff that I don't understand. Kind of like, you know, if you can't take basic pictures, what's the point of getting an expensive camera if you don't even know how to use it, you know, utilize it properly. So that's where I'm at. Um, but yeah, I just love looking at others and see how they do things and just kind of be like, okay, like I see how like that transitioned or like, okay, I definitely love like the way that this, this footage is, um, color logged and all that or color graded. Yeah. Color graded. Um, and it's just like, it's just really, really cool. Um, to see but just ultimately i just love seeing people's styles peek through um because you can really see like how a person is and like what they like and you know what um what they want you to see too so you know we're trying we're trying it's a work in progress i think we're six videos in so six videos really hope to be good um well the goal is always like to be better after like after each video like to learn something new or get different feedback and yeah I'm just hoping just to get better with each video I mean it has to get better going to the park they just opened up the new playground so I'm taking Jackie Whoa. Wow. how cool is it cool? Yeah. All right, let's go play, Mama. We want to put our stuff down? Should we put it over here on this table? Yeah, let's, let's make this our table. Okay, I'll help you. Ready to go play? Okay, let's go. All right, are we going up the stairs? Jackie's about to go down. And we Oh, where is she? Oh my goodness! Wanna try it?
<laughs> so we're in downtown right now. We just finished the park. It was so much fun, wasn't it? It was fun. Yeah. Where are we gonna go, Tingy? Where? What are we getting? Ice cream. Ice cream. We figured we would go get her some ice cream. We're gonna go get ice cream. Let's see what we're gonna get, Miss Jackie. What are we gonna get her? You like it? All right, I got you. Mommy help you, huh? Then, um, thumbs up. So we did a little shopping. What did you get, Mama? Backpack. Yeah, so pretty, huh? Black backpack. Yeah. That's the Eiffel Tower. Hearts, flowers. So we are at Albertsons. I am currently looking for some protein. I already got some of the veggies and whatnot. But yeah, I am just trying to find something good to get. Where's the I hate when they move stuff because originally I found something and now it's not here anymore. Make it make sense? Funny thing is, I'm actually at the store once, once, maybe twice a week because, okay, maybe sometimes three times a week because I actually don't like over buying stuff anymore and I just want to go and get these these items. So I just picked up some frozen red, uh, red, green, yellow bell peppers just so I can add it to the mix. Just kind of looking at some more stuff. I also got myself some tilapia fillets. Ready to cut when I get home. I think we'll go to Costco this weekend, so I'm gonna hold off on my yogurt. Hey guys. So we are home from our little shopping. Um, I took Jackie to Marshall's and um, Albertsons. I'll say Stater Brothers, what the hell? So yeah, let me show you guys what we got. So from Marshalls, um, you saw her backpack already, but I wanted a little roller, so I got a mini roller. And we can never have too many of these. So I got a new shaker bottle for Kong and for me. Um, they were cheap, they're like six bucks. So decided why not because we literally use them every single day and I know I use them every single day so why not alright put this back okay and at Albertsons this is her water bottle let me take that out okay so I got myself some scallions cilantro I wanted to make jello, so I got sugar free jello. I love the green apple. Kong and Jackie love the orange, so I got them these. Jackie loves tomatoes, so got her tomatoes. More tilapia, uh, frozen peppers. I got some salsa because I love salsa. Salsa with any of my food is delicious. I also ran out of sugar free vanilla syrup, so I got this one just in case it actually is good. We'll see. And I got me some vitamins. Just finished, just finished making my lunches today and then I didn't have time for rice so we are bringing this because this is the best, this is the best instant rice so far that I've tried. So yeah, we have our tilapia, frozen um, peppers, 
and a little green garnish with the green onions and cilantro. So Kong got some options for dinner. It's either some ribeye, some of this hot Italian chicken sausage because macros are really good on this one. Or um, we're going to do some tacos. And I think I'm going to go with tacos because these are just super simple to make and fast. How was your day? Good. What you do? You play? Where'd you play? Uh -huh. Okay. Jackie wants to help me cook, so I'm gonna bring out her. Little stool thing. Let's turn it this way a little bit. She's currently sitting on the edge. Down. Down? Yes, Mama. Let's have you. Let's get you in. <laughs> All right. Let's cook. There you go. Good job. Awesome. Wow, good job. You're doing so good. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Good job. Now let it sit. Okay. Say hi, everybody. Hi, buddy. Say, how are you? Jackie. <laughs> Good job. Look at Jackie being the best helper. Use his hand. Okay. Okay. Look, use that hand. Hold this. And do that. And keep it there. Okay, y'all. Okay. Wow. Wow. Can you y'all? Yeah. Wow, can you yoy? Good job, Mama. <laughs> okay, here, Mommy, help.
Okay, so we just added in all of the seasoning for this, and we're just going to let it do its thing now. We're just going to let it do its thing. Jackie is currently eating her snack. Jackson is actually back upstairs now, so that's exciting. Um, since he's now back to eating, we definitely need to give him his allergy medication again because he's starting to break out. He's scratching a lot. Um, when he was injured, he didn't feel like eating as much, so there was no issues with his skin. But he is back to scratching. It's very red. Um, it just ugh, it terrifies me knowing that like this boy is so sensitive to everything. He definitely did not start out like that. All right, I'm gonna let it, this do its thing and get everything else ready. Okay, so basically food is done. I'm just gonna go ahead and plug it into my wonderful MyFitnessPal just to see how much I can really eat today. So um, I already have the 90-10 ground beef already logged in so I'm gonna add that um, I don't want to search for this so I'm just going to scan this let's see all right three taco shells we have some cheese that I'll add into that Jackson stop scratching let's see um, and then everything else should be solid. Like, I really don't track my lettuce at times, but for the sake of it, I'll track it because... What the heck? My fitness pal. Guys, this makes zero sense. Okay, you guys clearly see... Oh, it was so weird. It gave me some, like, donut earlier. So weird. Um, but I will be having some lettuce. I still have quite quite a ways to go. So I, I still have protein and carbs to hit. Um, let's see. Oh, I don't have yogurt. I think I'm done. Okay, let me see what I can do. I actually don't think I have a full serving. So I think I have half a serving of yogurt left. Let's add in some raspberries. Some blueberries with some agave okay we added those in i still have quite a ways to go with my carbs what is this hmm okay yeah i just i still have 122 carbs nine fats and 34 protein to go Ugh. This is what I get for not properly planning out my day. I started my day off a little bit on the, well, I woke up, my cycle started, so I was genuinely tired this morning, so I did not wake up to go to the gym, which I'm going later, um, and I did not plan out my meals. I'm just kind of doing it as I go, but gratefully that I am still, yes, baby? Oh, yeah, that's mama's. You want, oh, whoa, what's inside? <laughs> Okay, oh, put it inside. Okay, there you go. Uh oh. Um, I think I'm gonna add in some potatoes because I just saw some right now and I figured I could add in potatoes to make up for some carbs. Okay. Maybe I'm gonna do six potatoes. So I'll do a serving and a half. I'm still pretty low in my protein. Let's add in isopure, beautiful, I still have carbs, I still have carbs, let me see if I can add in, mm. what can I add in, that's going to be high carb, the, the struggle y'all. I'll be back. So I'm about to make some 
air fried potatoes. And guys, if you guys don't have one of these things, like the air fryer liners, y'all need to get you some because it makes cleanup a lot easier. Um, and I like to put in like two at a time, just so it can soak up more of like the fats and all that. Um, and I'm, I'm telling you guys, these are life changing. So glad Kong decided to research and get them. We've been using it for, I don't know, over a year, year and a half now, and it's great. So I have my potatoes here. And I'm just gonna put them on in. I'll be right back after I clean them. Whoa, look what Jackie made. Whoa. Are you gonna keep adding to it? Wow, good job, baby. Oh, almost got it. Oh yeah, look at that masterpiece. Oh, she's building. Oh no! <laughs> you, you do another castle? All right, let's build that castle, baby. Okay. All right, potatoes are in. We're gonna hit vegetables and we'll just start this. I just sprayed it with some of this um, zero everything spray. So I decided to get this up for Jackie. She's sitting on the inflatable bed and she's playing with her toys, watching Coco Melon Lane. You know, one of my hopes is that like we start something when she's a little bit older where it won't affect her on the day to day basis. But I want to do like Fridays. We do a little like sleepover type of thing where we do like a movie, movie night type of deal. And we just sleep on the couch and, you know, <laughs> it's one of my goals. I hope to do that with her. So gonna, I'm definitely gonna aim to do my workout in this area just because I have weights and it's just empty. Or maybe, nope, it's gonna be over here. It's so busy over there. All right, y'all, we are at the gym on a Friday night. Hitting some legs, I already did the sauna. And I did a little bit of Stairmaster. Oh God. I'm gonna roll out. Oh my God, my back. Same issue, back is still tight as ever. Have I fixed it? No, I have not fixed it. I haven't gone. I got a massage done. I think it's been about to be two months now since this back started hurting in Japan. Oh. But I've been really trying to like stretch it, roll it out. I have a roller at home now. I also have a massage gun that one of my staff members lent to me been using it. Ooh, my upper back just cracked a little bit right now. Ugh. Does anyone ever feel like when they roll, they just keep rolling away? Ugh. Anyways, I'm really liking this new gym in Monrovia. And even though it's like probably three miles farther than my home gym, I don't know. Would I make the drive all the time? I don't know. Maybe on like the weekends I would, or like if I wanna like work out with one of my friends after work, I probably could hit up this gym. But for my 5 a.m. ones, sticking to my other one. Ugh. I wanted to work out in the group fitness area, but um, there were people in there and I just didn't wanna deal with it. Even though there are people out here, I'd rather work out out here. I really don't know how I used to work out and not stretch. Like, the younger body and the older body, the more mature body, they are just not the same. Ugh. Literally. 
hate how tight the hamstrings feel. Genuinely guys, I don't know why I have such a hard time with RDLs sometimes because I feel like sometimes I think too much and it's just causing me to just overanalyze and the more I think about something I feel like I'm not going to do it right and these are one of the movements where I don't know why it's been one of the difficult ones but we're just trying to get it right um i'm gonna record these send it to my coach and you know i've been picking up certain cues like sometimes i don't know why it's easier to do like barbell rdls than isolated every time it's isolated i feel like oh i feel a little off balance um, but that's why we're doing them because we're trying to strengthen each side individually and then not just go with the motion. So yeah. All right, let's let's get let's get into it. Let's let's get back into it. shoulder workout at the gym and I am heading home I didn't feel like filming anything truthfully because I just didn't feel like pulling out my camera today and the gym was popping and I was not trying to I was not trying to deal with that so no workout but just know I had a very solid shoulder workout I can actually feel it now so we will I hate when people can't fucking drive okay anyways just quick recap, I am going to make breakfast. I am going to do whatever cleaning I can. Um, Jack is gonna go down for a nap. Maybe I'll nap too, we don't know. Um, I will have to get ready to go to youth group um, and then head to one of my kiddos graduation party. So I'm really excited for today and I really don't know what's going on tomorrow. I have, I am undecided at this point, but we will see where the day takes us. Hi, buddy. Hi, everybody. Hi, buddy. How are you? Hey, Auntie. Happy Saturday. Happy Saturday. <laughs> it is mommy's turn to eat now. I am going to make kind of like a super easy, super quick breakfast burrito because we have ground beef left over from last night's dinner and I really don't feel like putting a whole bunch of things together so that's what we're gonna do um, I need to measure out my meat okay like when I tell you guys your girl is lazy today okay I'm lazy almost every day when it comes to making my food like as much as I love cooking and eating and all that it's just too much sometimes when all you want to do is eat. Okay, so let's do some of this. I'm aiming for two ounces. A little bit more. Two ounces of meat. All right, we have a little bit of this left over, so let me just put this in this bowl so I can clean this. I hate having so many dirty dishes or just stuff taking up the fridge. I guess a great thing that we have like a stock fridge, but I just don't like when there are we I don't like when there are just like a bunch of like unnecessary things in there. So 
there's a difference don't get me wrong okay and i do want to add maybe i could add a quick bit of egg white so i actually have some turkey bacon here just gonna add it in here nice and crispy oh, i love when they're nice and crispy it makes me happy i hate soggy bacon i don't i don't know maybe it's just me but i just really do not like soggy bacon you want chicken no no okay y'all jackie just knows what she wants the girl cannot be bothered oh i need to make my coffee too okay so once i get this situated i'm going to start making my wonderful coffee got that going a little non-stick spray perfect so i'll let that work what happened you want me to hold something you want mama to hold something okay And to my egg whites, I'm going to do a little bit of an onion cilantro mix. Let it do its thing. I'm not going to season it just because the ground beef is already seasoned with taco seasoning, which means it's already salty enough. Go, turn it. Oh, let's let's show everyone what you're doing. Go, you got it. Go, turn it. Oh yeah, you're doing it. Woohoo! Can you close it? The bottle. Okay, bottle. Bottle now. Okay. All right. Thank you. You're such a good helper. You're such a good helper. So this is not going to be a burrito because there's no way I'm folding this, but it'll be a nice big breakfast taco. I don't know. It's something. Clean this in a bit. Let me add my cheese because we got cheese. Wow, good job. Where's my cheese? Oh. Huh? You want five? Five? There's five? Yes. Okay, really? Count for mommy. Uh-huh. Two. Four. Five. Six. Seven. We have seven. We have seven, mama. Now to add some salsa to it. All right, so those are in. Oh, bless you. I got you. Miss Ma'am got some allergies going on today. I'm using counter culture. Hold on. Counter culture. Pretty decent. Um, I really have nothing to compare it to. I have fills here too, but I just really have been liking this counter culture one a whole lot more than the fills. Um, not too sure why. It was actually recommended to me, so. I don't know. I think I still have to play with this machine a little bit more. Okay, cool. So I have seven, oh, it'd be nice if I turned it on. Okay, turn that on. What's up, mama? Let's do a quick wipe down of this. I see a few spots on here that bug me. I just don't like my machine being dirty. All right, quick wipe of this. Need to take this out for a nice clean. All right, cool. So it's nice and clean now. Okay, nice and pretty. Let me get you a plate, Mama, so you can put it on the plate. All right, you want to add stickers? 
we go here. I'm having her add stickers to a thing. Okay, let me open this up. So I already added in my syrups. So later on, once I put this here, it can just come on down and mix with the syrup. But I'm going to get my beans ready first. So now that this is all pushed in, I think it's called tampered. I don't even know. I'll learn. You did it, mama? Pink. Well, pink. I see pink. What's the other color? Green and the other color, what color? Yellow. Yellow. Mm hmm. All right. So I'm going to learn those terminology soon. But putting this there, adding my cup with the syrup in, and simply pressing start. Double shots, always. My favorite part always is the pour. Literally, favorite part, because then once you mix it, it looks so pretty. So delicious. So I have my coffee and I have my breakfast taco burrito situation. We are going to, where are we going, Mama? Going to the store. So, um, Jackie actually loves going to the store, specifically um, the one by our house. It's kind of like a ritual for her, daily routine, likes going to the store. But today I'm going to Target because there are some things we need for the house. So, um, yeah, I need to get some stuff for the house and I figured Good time to do it. Um, I have nothing to do right now. Kong is going to watch a volleyball game and it's a, it's a mommy daughter day. We're at the store. We're looking for stuff for Jackie. Some more pajamas. Should we get new pajamas for you? Pink car. Oh yeah, is that a pink car? What color is the car? Pink. Pink. Okay, so we got one pajamas for you so far. Let's see if we can find another one. Oh, these are cute. These are cute, mama. Tutti. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah? I feel like she's growing so fast, so I feel like she's going to be in between sizes soon. So, um, I don't even know what size I want to get her. Oh, my gosh. She's so funny. There's an ice cream one. She loves ice cream. Um, yeah, contemplating on what I want to get her. There's a 3T one, but I'm like, do I get 3T or 4T? Super cute. All right, let's keep shopping. All right, guys, let's do a quick little haul. We just got back from Target, um, and I'll show you guys what we got. Let me clean up this area real quick before I do my wonderful haul. Just want to make sure I'm not placing my stuff onto a dirty countertop. All right, so time for the haul. Um, like I said, it was a very quick Target run. Let me put my purse down. Came back with these. The cool thing about these is that they're collapsible. So I'll show you guys what they look like when I'm done. Let me get my water bottle out because that's not part of the haul. So I got some of these. Um, I put one at the front door already, so that's why it's missing. But it's a nice variety pack. So we got the Linen Sky, I think it was some other downy one, and then this April Fresh. They all smell really good. Floss for Jackie. Um, Q-tips, because we are out of Q-tips. What happened? Huh? Where's Jackson? Where's car? Yeah. We'll go, we'll look. 
got this for Jackie. It is a cereal container. So you put the milk down here and you put the cereal up here. I always carry her stuff in like two separate um, containers and it comes with a spoon. So I figured why not? It's like three bucks. Yes, babe. This bottle cleaner, jar cleaner, comes with a straw cleaner. Definitely feel like we need a new one. So we got pans for Jackie. We got some black ones, some black glitter ones, and some gray ones. So all leggings because these are the fastest and easiest, most comfortable things for her to wear when she goes to daycare or when she goes out in general. So got these ready for Miss Ma'am. Some cards because we have events coming up. Uh, it's for me because I'm in need of new ones. Um, this this is the pajama set we ended up going with. It's super cute. Flower, nice and light, especially because summer's coming up. So I'll be washing these. Hair ties, can never have too many hair ties. Always miss them. And then, and then I also got mouthwash because fresh breath. This is the basket and it basically just folds in like this and it then folds down. Take this out. And it folds down like this, super convenient. Um, I'm gonna do it again with this one, literally super easy fold up. And then it folds down like that and you can just keep it in your car. It's like super, super convenient. So I'm gonna keep this in my car, but I do need to clean my trunk out. Um, funny thing we haven't really decluttered not decluttered what's the word so when we hosted Jackie's birthday at my parents house my parents were telling us to leave some stuff at the house because they didn't want us to just be stressed and tired and move all the stuff at once but I literally told them like I need to do this or it's not going to happen and I was right because we've left some stuff like it's not a whole lot right we took a good chunk back like panels da 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 tables all the things that are big we took back, but a lot of the other things um, have been there since February. I just picked some up, picked some stuff up like last week. So that's been a whole, what, like three, three, oh, oh what is this? Okay, mommy will fix it, okay? So it's been like a whole like three months. Oh, you see the fly? Y'all, yeah, she's been so annoyed with this fly that's been going around last night kong was telling me how she looked at the fly and was like get out get out because it was like in her room so cute but anyways i'm gonna clean this up <clears throat> i'm gonna clean this all up probably get some lunch going and then see where that takes us because we do need jackie to go down for a nap um yeah before i make lunch i want to make jello so decided to get this sugar-free jello I have the hot water boiling right now. I told Kong I wanted to make jello this weekend and he was like, jello shots? All right, and then it says to refrigerate until firm. Jackie, what did you build? Oh, you made a castle? She literally was like asking me to record it. She pointed at the camera. Look at that. Well, Jackie, you want to sit next to it? Okay, go. Go sit next to it. Sit next to it. So I can take... Wow, Jackie, the master, your masterpiece. Good job. All right. Oh, you, oh is that your new car? You want to show your new car? Let's see. Whoa, let me see. What color is it? Green. Green? Wow, new car, huh? What color is that car? Red. Red. Wow. Oh, the truck's going to carry this car? <laughs> vroom, vroom. Beep, beep. Beep, beep. Awesome. Oh, no. Oh, no. It's going to, it's going to. <laughs> Funny. Okay, go ahead. Build another castle. Press. Okay, now it's recording. Okay, you want to record what you did? Yeah. Okay, look, guys. Look, guys. Look what I made. Look what this. Yeah. Is it a castle? Yes. Okay, how cool. Can you mommy take, record you next to your castle? 
Yay, you made your castle. Yummy lunch. My very late lunch. On the way to church um, for youth group, Jackie is not with me today. She is still napping. The girl was not fighting for her nap, but she literally didn't want to go nap. But the most ironic thing is the more she puts up a fight, the more tired she is. So she literally fell asleep within like not even five minutes of laying down. Um, do I hear? I thought I heard the ambulance or something. Um, but yeah, I am currently trying to figure out what the hell these people are doing. I don't understand. Sometimes I just don't understand how some people got their licenses. But yeah. Anyways, um, I already did my face. I didn't get to do my hair. Unfortunately, I didn't prioritize enough time to get my hair done. But it's okay. At least the face is like decent. I just put foundation on, contour, blush. Um, I have some falsies on. Uh, just to, you know, brighten up the eyes a little bit. But I didn't really want to do too much. I was not trying to do all of that. I need to write in the card. And, um, yeah. I need to send Kong the address. Because we're he's going to be meeting me there with Jackie. The game plan was, was he was going to meet us. But now with Jackie napping <laughs> and not waking up, I am going to meet them there. I should have napped, but I didn't. Why? Because I was on Amazon. Guys, the 210 never fails. I only like this freeway when it's late at night because there's no traffic. Um, usually mornings and afternoons, early evenings, the 210 is popping. Popping. Um, especially during the weekday when I need to go to work, when I come home. It's just insane. Uh. When I was younger, I used to figure skate competitively. And there's a rink here. It's now like belongs to like the Ducks. They're well, actually it no longer exist. Anyways, there was an ice rink there. And... It was actually my very first competition that I believe I won second place at and I felt so freaking amazing. Um, so yeah, this Golden West like ice rink was my very first competition, my introduction into the competitive figure skating world and your girl placed second. Guys, you guys good? Yeah. <laughs> Alright guys, so we are home now, I'm going to get Jackie something to eat before she heads to bed and I'm going Mommy. to Mommy. edit the vlog, Mommy. post it. Yes baby? Hi buddy. She wants to say hi everybody, come yes. here. Say hi everybody. Hi buddy. Say enjoy sure. the vlog. Oh, is that your ball? Yes. Okay. All right, mommy's gonna make you food, okay? Okay. Okay. So yeah, I'm gonna make her food real quick. I'm gonna edit the vlog, call it a night, 
probably try to see Jim early because I'll probably be awake early and then we're gonna go to Disneyland. Okay, peace out.